The myths and misconceptions of anti-aging. Oh, where do I start from? There are so many myths and misconceptions and marketing gimmicks by companies that want to sell you subpar products that are mostly water, preservatives, fillers, silicones, and tiny bit of the actives that make you want to feel like you're having a great product because it's being branded by big celebrities and it has a fancy luxury looking packaging but in reality it doesn't offer you what it promised you to do. Well in this video I'm going to share the common myths and misconceptions about anti-aging and some tips on how you can age naturally and gracefully. There are a lot of myths and misconceptions around anti-aging and it's hard to know what to believe. In this video, I'm going to share some common myths and misconceptions around anti-aging. You need to start wearing anti-aging products in your 20s. Well, that is not true. You can start wearing anti-aging products as early as your teens. I want to thank my mother for telling me to wear an eye cream at the age of 16. And I'm now in my middle 30s and I do not have resting uh, eye wrinkles. I do have expression eye wrinkles, but I do not have resting eye wrinkles. So whilst I'm not doing any facial expressions, I do not have any eye wrinkles. Thank you, mom. Only expensive anti-aging products can work. Well, this is not true. There are a lot of affordable anti-aging products out there, but there are a lot of them as well that promise you a lot, use a lot of marketing gimmicks. They're not formulated with densely packed antioxidants and minerals. They promise you a lot and they don't actually do much. Well, if you want to learn more about how to understand the ingredients in your cosmetics, this is really my bread and butter. I love this content and I'll be sharing more about this on coming up videos because it's a lot more to unpack and today I just want to focus a little bit more on the higher level of anti-aging myths and misconceptions. Quick, recently I've been contacted by a lovely gentleman who bought my super antioxidants face cream and he told me that normally he uses a face cream that costs 450 pounds, listen to this, for 50 ml. That is like a fortune and okay I went and I looked into the ingredients of the product I'm not going to reveal the company because I do not want to be uh, sued for defamation but the first ingredients were aqua dimethicone which by the way for some people it can cause acne it is a cheap ingredient it's a silicone that companies use it as to give this silky feeling and it gives a temporary um, cover of wrinkles but in reality this is not actually causing or giving any anti-aging effects and then followed up by other fillers and at the very very end after the preservatives we get the actives so this is why it's important for you to be a savvy skincare consumer so that you can understand the ingredients in your cosmetics. So if you also want to learn how to understand your ingredients of your cosmetics, make sure to follow, subscribe and join my VOP club of the Piotis Naturals email list because I'll be sharing a more in-depth report there on how to understand which ingredients to be avoiding and how to understand whether your product is formulated well and it's going to help your skin or whether it's merely marketing gimmicks, water fillers and tiny bit of the actives. You can't age gracefully if you have wrinkles. Well, that is not true. Depending on how deep your wrinkles are, you can combine good anti-aging products. Think about serums, vitamin C serums, think about face creams, and the use of microneedling and some other techniques that I can touch up on follow-up videos. And doing those consistently and applying them on your skin, uh, you can see positive results and diminish the appearance of the wrinkles. Now, here are some tips on how to age naturally and gracefully. Wear sunscreen every single day and ideally you want to start as early as possible. So it's important if you have children that are in their middle teens or late teens to educate them in wearing sunscreen every single day. And of course, you want them to be wearing a non-toxic sunscreen because why would you be putting harmful ingredients on them that can be impacting their health negatively? Eat a healthy diet full of vitamins, minerals with your vegetables, your fruit. This is so important. If you're not nourishing your body from within, then your body will not have the right nutrients to help your skin and your hair to look glowing and healthy. 
Get enough sleep. I can't stress this enough. Sleep is so important for your skin's and hair health. But when you sleep also matters. So if you sleep around 12 p.m. or 2 a.m., that is not the same as sleeping around 10 p.m. When you sleep matters because your body has certain time frames that does the uh, regeneration and the skin rejuvenation. So it's so important to be sleeping around 10 p.m. So I hope you try it out. Exercising. Exercising is so important for your body overall. We hear it all the time. Well, but why does it help your skin and your hair look better if you exercise? Well, whilst you exercise, you pump up blood all over your body, including your skin and your hair. And that helps pump more vitamins and nutrients to your skin and your hair. As long as it's something that you can maintain long term, then you can stick to it. It will definitely help you and it will show definitely on your skin and your hair what, that they will look more glowing and healthy. Manage your stress. Stress can be so debilitating to our health overall. Uh, it can compromise our immune system. It can deplete our body from certain vitamins and minerals, and it can lead to the production of more free radicals, which in turn leads to more premature aging. So if you can find ways to manage your stress, naturally and in healthy ways you will see a lot of benefits in your skin so if you're somebody who's suffering uh, with premature aging and you're concerned about that because of stress trying to find ways to tackle your stress in ways that are healthy for you uh, things like going for a walk uh, drinking certain types of relaxing teas those are things that can help you manage your stress i hope you enjoyed this video and you learned something new around the myths and misconceptions of anti-aging and how to age gracefully and naturally well i haven't touched on all of the things around the myths and misconceptions of anti-aging it's a huge topic that i would like to break down in more coming up videos but if you would like to know more about these in the meantime you can always follow me on all of my socials at POTS naturals so you can ask me questions directly there on my stories you can dm me and also, you can feel free to comment below on the video any other questions that you have around skincare and hair care, as well as any information you'd like me to explain more and clarify on what I have touched on this video. I hope that this video helped you understand that you can age gracefully and naturally, and aging is part of life, and we can do things to slow down the aging and make our skin and hair look as beautiful and healthy as possible. Until next time, you guys keep shining and stay happy and positive. Bye for now.